everybody, and welcome back to episode 93 of Sinarukana. Welcome back. We have averted the catastrophe. And Zomo drew on a bunch of power and still <laughs> wasn't quite able to hold out and got pretty badly injured. He held out for quite some time. <laughs> yeah, he got rid of them all, uh, so yeah, I guess he... Held out, but not the without a scratch quotes <laughs> that he said before. So apparently he still wasn't able to draw her Aurora's full power. Not even close. Like he wasn't even trying to draw her to full power, just draw more of the power. I mean, yeah. More. A little more than ten percent. <laughs> Percent, didn't he say? Yeah, he said ten percent, uh, one tenth. Uh, so yeah, ten percent huh? is all he's accessed up till now. <laughs> Where am I getting twenty from? I don't know. Getting from somewhere. Oh well. Ah shoot! I didn't allocate the screenshot between episodes. I just kind of hit stop and then immediately hit start again. <laughs> Oh well, let's see if there's another screenshot I want in this one. Yeah, let's see if there's another one. No way! Nozomu! Whew. Looks like he's fine. Fine? Not quite the right word. It looks, it looks like he's alive. He's covered in blood. Yeah, go easy on me. I stagger on the Naya's shoulder. I'm exhausted and know that this is kind of pathetic. But it's also proof that I really accomplished something. Yatita, Josita, treat him. Hi, hi. That's no debate, eh? Yep, yep. My turn now. Anyway, I'm glad you both made it back alive. Yeah, the, the Jazita might be our like official nurse, but Salas, both you and Zomi would be way better treating him with your powerful ass healing magic. Seriously, Solace's healing magic is even stronger than the Zomi's. No, think of it this way, though. You need the red magic because that, <laughs> you know, like, burns the wounds to prevent them from getting infected. There wouldn't be any wounds, uh, uh, Solace. No, it's like, he just closes them up, but if they're already infected, then that's internal stuff. You don't know if magic can help the insides. You need to <laughs> Prostrate the wounds to make sure they don't get all infected and stuff. Did you say castrate the wounds? When I don't know a word, I just confuse. <laughs> I think the word you want is cauterize. It's better than using circumvent. Can <laughs> <laughs> So I don't think you can circumvent those wounds once they've already happened. Hmm. Mm, just by a thread. I'm sorry, we worried you. Listen to yourself. The tower's still standing thanks to you. Yep, you did really well, Naya. And you too, Nozomu. Um, Nozomu? <laughs> Guess this is as far as I go. The world spins in front of me, and I slump forward. I can't move a muscle anymore. Not even to keep my eyes open. At least he didn't suck and burn those wounds fast enough. Whoa, 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 are you okay? 
心配ないバカ者は無理をしたから疲れておるだけじゃ Don't worry, the idiot push himself too hard. そうだったらいつものことかな<笑> I was expecting a Saluska to say something. Like, what? No, I didn't do anything! Oh, same as usual then. He's trying to tell others not to be reckless, so being more reckless than anyone. Well, but, but the tower is fine and we are here now. It's thanks to that recklessness. I'm grateful to him. <laughs> I listen to everyone talking. Okay, you got a really bad echo that needs fixed. Yeah, well, how do you propose I fix it? I still don't know where those earbuds are. <laughs> well, let's tap on it or something, because it like, like just started, so it was fine before. I really are feeling it early as well. I just muted my microphone. Right, I listened to everyone talking around me. I did everything I could and managed to protect them all. Enjoying that sense of victory. My mind slowly fades to unconsciousness. Oh, so slowly. Well done, Zomu. You protected Naya and the Tower of Support. Hmm, time for a nap. I'm really tired too. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he used most of Rebe's energy as well. Mission <laughs> <laughs> result. That was one long mission. Wow, I got an S rank! Awesome! Okay, now we know the secret, you just have to spend a week on the mission. <laughs> well, uh, 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 um, I think it's Avum, uh, been talking to me at the comments, giving me some tips on, uh, Certain some things and basically the S rank, uh, like I thought I remembered from Acelia, is uh, solely how quickly you finish the mission. It's not how much damage you take or deal or anything like that. You just have to finish the mission, and we should be getting an Eternal Relic from getting an S rank. Uh, and apparently, you get uh, if you actually manage to double S something, which is really hard. You get the. Um, a relic that is the one from the next chapter. So nice. you kind of get an early power boost, but it's really hard to double S something. Apparently there's an artifact I can build that will speed up my the, the time it takes me to take my turns immensely. I thought I went over all the artifacts, but maybe I missed that one because I thought the mana conversion one was like the only one useful for being outside of the stronghold that you built it in. But I might have to take a look at them again in the next mission if I remember it. Not that okay. I'm really going to strive hard for a double S rank. <laughs> but uh, having faster turns would definitely be nice. True. Yep. See? Cedar Forest Wind. Is this a new one? Looks like everybody. I think so. I don't remember this one. Or no, 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 this is it. Because uh, I remember passing on Dual Edge 2 to get... What did I get? Oh, Reptuna's Rain Dance 2. Yeah, she's the one not listed there. Okay. 
as I was saying, it sounds new, but then again, it's been a week. <laughs> yeah, it's been a week. Uh, so let's refresh my choices, although Dual Edge 2 is obviously extraordinarily attractive. How about how attractive it is? It's about the usefulness. <laughs> Heaven's Javelin. Ah, like in a bard. She's actually, she's actually been pretty good on the attacking roles. She's kind of been my strongest dual elemental attacker. So area Assault is pretty sufficient. Let's do anything... But it does lower defense skill uses. And, low, and dispels effects that boost endurance and resistance. That's actually really neat. That's really neat. Yeah, your devoted block is plenty strong enough with your endurance. Ah, uh, oh, that's the one I tested out on Sorluska and pretty much decided it's totally useless. <laughs> Wow, skill level 9! What does it do, though? It doesn't do any damage or anything. No, oh, that boosts the red as attribute of terrain. I wonder how much. Oh, that's another thing Avon pointed out for me, is that those encounter skills, where I've been thinking they boost things 20%, they actually boost the stat that it says it boosts by 40%. And lowers the one it says that it lowers by 30%. Quite the benefit. Yeah, like a significant thing to keep in mind when I, uh, that I need to pay attention to when I see uh, enemies having the white supporters. With the encounter skills. Uh, not that there's really anything I can do about them. I just need to be prepared for <laughs> almost 50% stronger attack skills. <laughs> Um. Anyway, so yeah. Pfft. I wonder how much that raises the red attribute by skill level 9, so it's pretty much uncounterable at this point in the game. <laughs> Earth Prayer 2. <laughs> My god, look at the healing power of that. 45%. That is very attractive. If I got that for him, I could probably use him as an all-rounder, even if the enemies do have a force attack. They ain't gonna be able to do 45% of his hit points in fours, considering he's got like 3,200 health. <sighs> so what, 1,400, 1,500? That's kind of attractive, too. Avalanche is... Lowers endurance, but... Weaker in the physical, stronger in the force. <laughs> Mountain strike... Oh yeah, that's the one that targets the attacker. Free combat mana, although I could use Dark Spring to boost his combat mana. Just take him a little bit of damage. A lot of these are pretty darn good, really. Stronger version of Fire Cloak. Just imagine if you're going the double S bank and could choose one from the next chapter. I yeah. wonder, what if, what if you get double S bank in the last chapter? Like, like, it wouldn't make sense to get any bonuses for the last, in the last chapter unless there's a boss you have to fight afterwards. <laughs> well, like I said, there's almost guaranteed to be a New Game Plus option for this where you keep all the skills and artifacts and everything that you've obtained and they go, go into a much harder, the enemies be much harder. 
I, th I think if I remember right, in Acelia, the new game plus, they were like 50 levels stronger in the beginning okay. of the game. Huh? Oh, what, did your new friend tell you about this, too? No, no, I'm just going off speculation and uh, what I How semi remember from Acelia. How far is that going you in this one? Ahem, all rounders. Ahem. <laughs> anyway, uh. <sighs> yeah, I think I'm gonna take that so that I can use him as an all rounder if I need to. So he's got really strong attacks, though. And he's pr pretty much immune to physical damage, but has no defense against magic, but a 45% heal will negate <laughs> pretty much any anything lower than a Jazita level fireball. <laughs> Actually, I think it probably would uh, outheal her, even. Yeah. She does, what, 1100 damage? Uh, with hers. Yeah, she does about 1100 damage with it, and he's at 3200 health, so yeah, that would negate to even her power, that much power. There's a random cat at my window again. If I had taken that before, I probably could have soloed, uh, soloed, <laughs> uh, Burble Zerd with him, <laughs> with Solus. It's like, yeah, yeah, spells do full damage to me, but I heal them up immediately next turn. <laughs> it would be interesting to see. That <laughs> would indeed, but yeah, we're going to take it. Uh, don't mean the Earth Prayer anymore, then. Bam. Alright. And then probably the next one I get uh, one of these relics, I'll give Nozomu his stronger attack, since I'll probably want it for the next chapter's boss. So you normally use him for the boss fight? Yeah, I think Nozomu's pretty much given for any boss battle. Being the main character, no real surprise. <laughs> you can level a little bit more. Alright, so, oh good, Reinforcer leveled up, uh, maybe just, Thalia's Reinforcer leveled up, that's amazing, now she'll be able to level up everybody some more, because she was the highest Reinforcer I had before. Of course you're going to have to wait for that. Ah, oh, there's all move. Good morning. And another thing is apparently I should also uh, disassemble any artifacts I've created right before fighting the final boss of the chapter so I can get some mana back from them. A little late for this one, but... Just a touch. <laughs> Zomi anxiously steps up to me. It's like, thank you, Avum, for all the useful tips. <laughs> Hope I'm remembering your name right. <laughs> I'm not good with names. Neither am I. Are you well enough to be up already? Well, it's probably already been like three weeks. Unless there's like... Unless there's... <laughs> It's like really funny names that after you hear them a couple times, it's hard to forget. It's like Burble Zerd. <laughs> I was about to call him Beelzebub. <laughs> you know, one of, the t one of the names for the devil? I'm still a little sore, but I've healed enough to walk around at least. So, that's it. Oh, thank goodness. Just eat his treatment work, then. I thought she was all looks, but it turns out she's a real doctor after all. Seriously, I was a little surprised. 
After seeing that I'm okay, Nozomi smiles from ear to ear in relief. Sorry I worried you. Jeez, you really did. When I saw you drape over Naya's shoulder, I thought you were dead and my heart skipped a beat. Sure you weren't just hoping that I was dead? <laughs> well, actually... I laugh as I grab Nozomi by the bangs. Why, you little? <laughs> it's just a joke. Oh, a joke, huh? Obviously, I was really worried about you. No, not just me. Everyone was. Sorry about that. Yeah, don't be so reckless like that ever again. I don't like you when you do that. <laughs> I'll try to stay on your good side. Don't try. Promise. Promise? She sticks out her pinky. I made it with my own and tweak it a little. Ow, why'd you do that? No reason. I was worried about you, you jackhead. Sorry, sorry. Haven't you been acting worse lately? Fighting constantly will twist you like that. That's not okay. That's exactly when you've got to get a grip on yourself. Alright, alright. I'm really hungry though. Oh, Nozomu. Good morning. Good morning. I was on my way to the cafeteria for breakfast. Want to come with me? Good timing. I was just thinking about it. Okay, we'll go together. I was going to ask him. Haven't you eaten already? <laughs> yes, I was going to bring him with me. Hey, let go! Why do you have to be so close to him just to take him there? Me. Getting so worked up. We're just going to the cafeteria. Whatever. Nozomu, over here. Good morning. Morning. You're all up early. Nozomu, karada wa mou yoi no ka? Nozomu, are you okay already? Yeah, just fine. So ka, sore wa nani yori ja? I see. That's good to hear. After getting my food, I find an open seat. Boku. Can I sit next to you? Yeah, I don't... Mm -mm. Before Rapetna can sit down, Nozomi forces herself between us and takes a seat herself. 
That's what I was about to sit. Oh, sorry. I'm already here. <laughs> then I'll take the other side. <laughs> so Suki's already taken the other seat. Get on his lap. So noisy, so early. Does it really matter where you sit? <laughs> You're just being snooty because you got the seat right across from him. Not in any way snooty. So, how's the tower? Nothing else happening with it? Hmm. Peace and quiet. But it did take a lot of damage. There's a lot of reconstruction to be done. My brother's already working on it. He's recovered already? Yeah, he was just knocked out. He barely remembers anything about what happened. Perhaps Evolia took his memories. Philomera is okay too. Oh, that's a relief. But she doesn't remember anything that happened. That's probably a really, really, really good thing for her. <laughs> we wanted to ask what happened when Evolia... <laughs> when Evolia took over her body, but... She planned for that. She used Philomera and then covered her tracks. That's very like them. The others finished eating already and went to guard the tower. Should we just be relaxing here then? You are still recovering, you need to rest. That's right, leave the heavy lifting to the meathead. She must mean Sir Luska. I guess if he's not here, she'll say whatever she wants about him. Once the tower is fixed, we'll get up. We'll get the up-to-date coordinates for your rail. Just relax until then. Then we start today, y'all. Hooray! It's been a while since we've had a chance to relax. Yay! What should we play? <laughs> oh, I just met Nozomu. You all still have, to have work to do. We'll be gone in the tower and she is.
望むたちのおかげでザルツバイは今極めて平穏じゃ。So、Sway is in peace now thanks to all of you. It wasn't just us. You did a lot too. So, I think we're in a lot of good time. So, we're in a lot of good time. So, we're in a lot of good time. So, we're in a lot of good time. Thank you for saying that. Now then, since it's so peaceful, I've decided it's time to take action. Action? Is it that I can't get out of the way? I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I've been considering it for a while. This land is at peace now, but who knows when the Lightbringers will attack again? Yeah. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I must change the minds of the passive people here. Peace does not fall from the heavens, it must be taken with our own hands. In other words, it's time to take the fight to them. Now that, now that finally sounds fair to the intro. ブレナわらわは元からこの魔法の世界の大統領ぞ。How rude! I've always been this world's president! ナイアちゃんがその気ならきっと変われると思うよ。If that's how you feel, then I'm sure you'll be able to change things. Yep! そうか。みんなもそう思うか。I see. You all think so too. <laughs> Before, Naya was almost always brooding over herself and her country's future. Now, she's like a completely different person. Something changed in her during that battle, and I think it's for the better. I believe in her. She'll be able to lead this world in the right direction. Da, 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 da. People talk in the distance about repairing the Tower of Support. Zetsu and Nanashi keep a careful ear on them while they manipulate the tower systems. Most of the security is gone, just as expected. No problems then. Although there will still be people coming in for here for repairs. There are no problems, Master. Okay, begin. Don't get caught. Yes. Setsu steps back and keeps an eye on their surroundings while Nanashi inputs commands. He keeps his hand tight on his sword within the nest of computers and machines. He's not looking at them, but at something beyond the tower's walls. Will I reach my goal soon? It's been too long. Yes, preparations will be finished within ten minutes. So, okay, now there's just him. Yes, his eyes drop down to his side as he takes a photograph out of his pocket. A small smile teases on his lips. Nanashi becomes anxious about that lonesome, nostalgic smile, but he doesn't notice. Destruction command set and targeted. Coordinate 
Imp important error correction complete. All going well. Next up is. Yes, forcing his power to react. When it does, the order will execute. Got it. Alright, let's call him. He puts away the photograph, and Nanashi begins to glow. It will all be over soon. My fight, and this world. Found. Call him. Yes, master. Oh. Setsu looks out the window into the distant blue skies. You have something to say? No, I don't. <laughs> His spirit. Reime, was it? She seemed to be rather chatty. You're the complete opposite. She is simply crass. Gehinka. Daga. I think I told you, she's in general. <laughs> Crass, huh? But she's a good spirit for him. Quite the meddlesome little thing. Master. Nanda. What? Um, no. It's nothing. So ka? I see. Alright. Time to wait. Yes. Everyone besides Zetsu and Nanashi is gone from the area now. He stares out the window again at the dock where Manobi is resting. There's no sound but the humming of the machines. When he closes his eyes, he feels like he stepped into a completely different world. Now, hurry here. Time, come to me. It's time to meet our destiny. Well, that seems... Very vague, ominous, and promising. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure exactly what to make of that. What is our time at? Still, I'm not gonna... still not really certain uh, what Zetsu's all about here. We got a little bit longer. Oh, apparently have a message though. It ain't nowhere near time for our game. It's probably my other game chatting. Yeah, I'm not sure if we have time for another, to do another episode uh, quite right away. I know we've got time off, but you're getting lazy. Getting? After her eighth giant yawn, I nudge her in warning. We were told to get some rest. Not just sit around. Even if the enemy's withdrawn, we can't relax until the so tower of support's completely repaired. <laughs> Look, you. Yeah. Manda, Nanjimo Nemuino de la Nainaka. 
say, aren't you sleepy too? I can't say that I'm not, but I'm sure she infected me with her own yawning. I'd never do that on my own. Well, we'll be going back to a long world soon. How about to fight off my sleepiness and... How about we fight off our sleepiness and make some memories today by wandering around outside? I wonder if the, what Zetsu set to be destroyed is our world. It's possible. Except why would he need Natsoma's power to trigger it? Because he has the power to destroy worlds. Pretty sure that Zetsu probably does as well. Yeah, but he doesn't I'm want uh, getting a very strong suspicion that he's going to be... that he's likely to be the end boss and his only ultimate rival. Think about it, though. Just think about it. If he... if Nozoma used up his entire Eternity Sword's power, he could probably destroy a world. Supposedly. But apparently, when someone tries to use up this sword's entire power, he will often kill them. Yeah, I guess there is that. Zetsu doesn't want to die just to destroy a world, but if he takes Nozomu's power to destroy it, he won't die. Hmm. Yeah. Hey, you want to go outside? Hmm, even if we're just supposed to be waiting, it's good for you to get out and move around. People are still People pretty up. You got that echo back. Yeah, I know, it would, it would happen. People are still pretty busy rebuilding. But the towers, but the town's more or less back to its usual self. I heard some of the students are even wandering around looking for souvenirs. Maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to go out then. Okay, I'll call everyone and we can go out. Hmm, <laughs> Hmm, Remy? She suddenly stops mid-sentence and tumbles off my head. I quickly catch her to keep her from getting hurt. She's staring off into the distance, barely even aware of what just happened. What's the matter? What is this? What am I sensing? Remy? A chill runs down my spine, and I shiver. It's not quite fear, but close to it. It's like someone's watching me. It's the same thing I felt when we first arrived in this world. Only a thousand times stronger. What is it? Hey! Are you okay? <laughs> Uh, I'm fine, but I feel like someone's calling me. You're not just imagining it? You just thought that you could feel it too! Yeah, well, he, he's feeling very nervous right now and wants to lower his own nerves, <laughs> by seeing if it could just be something of the imagination. He doesn't want to believe that it's real, so he is trying to play it down. <laughs> That's how these kinds of things work. I'm not! Look at that! I glance down to where she's pointing. Aurora is glowing faintly. What? 
Is this like Frodo's sword? Is there some? Is there an orc nearby? It's reacting. To what? An eternity sword like me. What's that mean? Probably daybreak. No. But then. I'm a little annoyed that Raymay's not being clear. The whole time, my exi ex 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 anxiety <laughs> just keeps building. I've got to get out of here. I've got to get away from whatever's looking at me. It's coming from the center of this world, Nozomu. Center? The Tower of Support? Mm. Hmm. If this restless anxiety is coming from there, that means that there's someone there waiting for us. I know I should call everyone else, but I can't stand this feeling. I need to get rid of it as quickly as possible, or it'll drive me insane. We're going to the Tower of Support, Raimi. Hmm, no objections. Let's go! I put her on my shoulder and race out of the room toward the tower. And now I think we're probably <laughs> done. <laughs> Yep, alright. So, we'll see what's awaiting us in the Tower of Support, like we don't already know, <laughs> next time. wonder it's if we're actually going to have to fight him. Probably. Three bosses in one chapter? We might not have to actually fight him. He might, like, <laughs> get one. might be a c cinematic fight that we get our ass kicked in, like the first one that, we, <laughs> that he was a part of. <laughs> Boy, but we'll see. We will see. Hopefully in the next episode. In the next episode, yes. Thank y'all for watching, and have a good one.